Hello, my name's Lisa and I work for Barnes & Museums, but today, like you, I'm at home. I was in my garden this morning and look what I found. A snail shell. But there was nobody living in it. And that got me thinking about my friend Norman. This is Norman. He was hiding in the plants. Come on Norman, slide this way and come and meet everyone. Norman is a bit like a snail, but a snail without a shell, which makes Norman a slug. And today's story is Norman the Slug with the Silly Shell. And it was written by Sue Hendra and the pictures were drawn by Paul Linnett. And we're sharing this story with permission from Simon and Schuster. Norman. The slug thought snails were great. Wow, said Norman. Look at them, they're amazing. But unfortunately, the snails didn't think Norman was great. Whee! <laughs> Norman, you silly slug, they cried. You've spoilt our fun. This only works if you've got a shell. Norman felt left out. Sadly, he skulked off into the moonlight. If only I had a shell, he sighed, looking at his reflection. And that's when he had an idea. Maybe I could have a shell after all, he thought. But finding a shell was not as easy as it seemed. One was too bouncy. One was too noisy. Ooh, that is noisy. One was already taken. Uh, Norman, uh, Norman, this is my house. Uh, Norman, this is my apple. Norman needed time to think. Ta-da! A shell. It was perfect. Norman had never been happier. He could join the snails at last. Norman loved being a snail. And the snails loved Norman's silly shell. But the fun didn't last for long. Suddenly, there was a loud flapping noise. Look out! Bird! cried the snails in a panic. Quick, slither for your lives or we'll end up as supper. But the bird was more interested in Norman's silly shell. It looked delicious. Norman was carried up, up, higher and higher into the sky. Well, what could he do? Norman did the only thing a slug could do. He made slime. Lots and lots of it. And with a slither and a slother and a slip and a slide, Norman was free. And he was falling faster and faster and faster until... Norman! Norman! Are you okay? asked the snails. Wow! said Norman. That was great. I love flying. If only I had wings. Come on Norman, let's get you down. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Come on Norman. Whee! 
you do like an adventure don't you Norman well that's the end of our story today I hope you've enjoyed it until next week it's goodbye from me and goodbye from Norman <laughs>